I see. Uh, and what is it your mother can't help you with? No, not, not. Your father must get back to work now. Okay? Okay. Ah, if it isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis-a-vis -vis Hanson. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Come on, Hans. Flattery, really? Seems a little beneath you. An overused tactic. Agreed. Unnecessary. No, V, this is strictly business. For those who do their work well, praise is a mere restating of the facts. Yeah, honestly, I wasn't expecting it to be that way. And also, shout out to his beard, though. I literally, I kid you not, every single time that I saw the shadow, I thought it was, like, actually his jaw. Like, his jaw was all the way down there. The entire time. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect, to see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hands in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. Of course. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. I bet. Were I to have more virtuosos like you, I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. To the point. Dogtown, Pacifica. Then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'll be done. I always forget that we met him within Pacifica. But we didn't really do much with him at that time. I think it was maybe like... Working with bona fide professionals. Positively a treat. Of course. Hope all that hard work won't go to waste. Profit for me means profit for you. Nothing simpler. Right. You may not know this, but I hasten to assure you no one has ever regretted doing business with me. Okay. I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. <sighs> Aim to undermine Hanson? Take it you prefer Dogtown with no Hanson at the helm. Hanson wields much power, greedily so. He's also clever. These traits I tolerate, even value when occurring in isolation. But all at once, no. Especially not in one who grips an entire district in the palm of his hand. It makes business... trying. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Ah, uh, why not? Fuck sure, it. why not? So, how did this combat zone become Dogtown? Do you know? <sighs> I do not know. Heard this and that. Something to do with the war? 2069. Colonel Hansen led an operation colorfully called Midnight Storm. The objective? To occupy this combat zone and establish an NUSA staging ground in Night City. Soon after, the sides agreed to a ceasefire. Hansen's force was left to fend for itself. Headquarters, the public, everyone feigned ignorance, pretending Hansen and company were never here. But our good colonel decided to put down roots. He declared this combat zone an NUSA territory. In our terms, he carved out an enclave for himself and went from soldier to arms dealer overnight. Mm hmm. It's fun. Oh, I can't Marooned drink. he was. Two weeks for a bullet to reach his brain, everyone thought. But his brain remained intact, and he became a force to be reckoned with. A man whose existence is a threat to many is a dangerous man indeed. Hmm. All right, well, 
It's all well and good chit chatting, but what about our deal? Did my part, time you did yours. Ah, indeed, yes. The Black Sapphire, Hanson stronghold, guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hansen guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But, given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate, and I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for. A token of my appreciation. I greatly appreciate that, thank you. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and, say, the late Mr. Deshawn. Wow! The Shard. Black Sapphire Info and Blueprints. All nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step. Thank you. Thanks, Hans. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local political gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change. Just allow me to drink, man. Like, oh, come on. Must. Someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Well, be looking forward to those new gigs then. You will hear from me soon. This, I guarantee you. All right. And V. Whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, make sure you come back alive, hmm? Of course. You're going where local and international politics mix. Strong currents, both. Make sure to plant my feet firmly, then. Later, hands. Right. Perfect. <sighs> well... We got stuff that we had. Thank you, Mr. Hands. Well, he's a family man, too. Who would have thunk? I'm wondering. A lot of hustle around. Got big guests in from the city. Mm hmm. Almost every day. We get all kinds of traffic in here from peeps looking to settle their biz in peace and quiet. Not many sides us can offer that. Two shots. All right, we'll take care. I think it's going to be time for me to head out, shall we? All right. Reed, got the data shard from Hans. Our golden ticket into the Black Sapphire. Perfect. Send it through. No worries. This connection's secure. Catch. It's on its way. And reception complete. I'll pass it on to Alex. And as soon as you're ready, join us at the Moth. If I'm not there when you arrive, just wait. Until then. All right. Okay, let us go. Mm -hmm. They went to the city to pick up the merch. Never came back. Relax. Mm -hmm. ah! All good, all good. Let's go, go, go. Check the court. Uh, 
Let's roll. Shit. Issues. This thing really runs on rails half the time, I'll admit. Granted. Wide open roads is what I would want to have. Fuck, fuck off, please, thank you. God, this is gonna suck ass. Wait, this is super fucking slow. I thought this was a caliber. It is a caliber, right? Not crazy? Okay, should still be able to get there. Gonna be close, but should be able to get there. Just about to miss it. Fuck. Oh, wait, I could still get it. 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 Fast enough, fuck. to drive that kind of sucks though i freaking i get the cops on me and that holds me up long enough for me to miss that that's so commando you're a bitch just out of left field this is just like yeah you're a bitch too fuck you uh you know the interesting part is i mean granted i think you guys are gonna be seeing this a little 
later on. But as this game is out, or at least as you're watching this video, uh, Forza Motorsports is out, and I'm like super happy about that too. It's like fuck yeah, get to get to drive and shit. What's this? Uh, hold on. Interesting item business has fallen to my lap. V. Lena Molina, local BD celebrity, claims she is kidnapped and currently being held against her will in a rental student called Brain Porium. Lena sends a bark, will free her from her captor's clutches. All in all, it would be a credible solid assignment were it not the fact that I failed to confirm the client's identity. What I received from her is that odds with several places with my trusted. Da, 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 da. I guess I'll have a poster or something? Yeah. Can't say I've always. Can't say I've been following our career, if one can call it such. Yeah, as always, I aim to keep my finger on the pulse of things. Well, I thank you. Got a new gig. Perfect. Anyway. Let's make sure we actually get it together. Why is it not... Oh, it's just not wanting to... Mark, huh? Up oh, and there's your other gigs. We'll do that. Ow. What do you mean this isn't the right way? What? I had to go down to Santo Domingo for that. Right! Forgot! Because technically the actual highway doesn't connect to that. Haha. -ha. Why would it? In the meantime, let me actually remove this since now my shit wants to work actually. Taking the racing path, okay? Ah! Ah! All units in Santa Domingo, a crime has been reported. Roger, dispatch. Standing by for coordinates. No, a crime, a crime has been reported. Really? Shit, that's surprising. Can't move, asshole. Ah! Oh. Why is my car not fucked? I don't know. Order has been restored. All units instructed to return to patrol. Ah, uh, boy. Guess this is what happens when I try to go a little bit faster than normal. But it's whatever. Ow. Fuck. Move you little shit. Thank you. The fuck you want? To all nearby units, suspicious activity reported in Pacifica. What? In Pacifica? No way! Copy dispatch. I'm en route. I have to say, I do appreciate the fact that these police... ...actually have... Suspect's vehicle has been located. Out of my way! I'm gonna kill him myself! Son of a bitch. All units, suspect has evaded patrols. Resume search immediately. We are totally just not going to talk about what just happened because I can guarantee you they definitely did not realize what was going on. <laughs>
I hate the fact that this thing is such a low right, low slung vehicle. What the fuck? Alex fucking city. I never turned to the left. What the fuck? I could they just don't give a shit about a car just driving through here. Yeah, they just don't care for, for the car. Let's just do a quick joggy jog. I just realized I only leveled up like six levels since we started this. Actually kind of impressed. It feels like I've done so much, but apparently it's like not a lot of it was XP based. <laughs> I guess that's kind of what happens. Oh, come on. Just casually losing my fucking brain. And dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Yeah, it's over. I'm not dead. Sit down. How can I help? Really? Starting to get used to it. This the relic? <sighs> Long story, but yeah. It's pulling a hostile takeover of my brain. You experience them often? These attacks? Don't really keep count, but... Never know if the next one won't be my last. Wow. Rough. No shit. Dad's breathing down my neck. Always. I know what that feels like. Hmm. Being a dead man walking? Exactly. I never talked about this, you know. I should be saying they tried to kill me, but sometimes it feels like they actually succeeded. Hmm. Tell me more. Ambush. Attempt on my life seven years back. Yeah, you said. What exactly happened there, Reed? I landed in the ICU. Why I waited for some Arasaka goon to come finish me off. I was betrayed. By our people. The FIA. I say betrayed. But I was sold out. Part of a deal. A peace offering. My head on a silver platter. All for a ceasefire. Peace comes at a price. Someone's always got to pay it. Come on. I'm going to show you something. <sighs> Hang on. They set you up. Yet here you are working for them again. Even deep wounds stop hurting eventually. Scar over. A few years on, they're just a niche. Let's go. All right. I mean, I don't think that's the best way of looking at it. But sure. Let's ride down. Where are we headed? On a little trip down memory lane to see some old junk. Okay. That's interesting. 
I still can't believe Alex decided the best place for a bar was right over our old safe house. She's always had a twisted sense of humor. Where's she at? Waiting downstairs? She's finishing up recon in town. We should make ourselves at home until she gets back. Honestly, I think it's a good spot to have like it's been dark for seven years this place. Let's brighten things up again. Yeah. Not gonna lie. I think it's a good place to have a safe okay, hello. Have a safe house, you know? Oh, well. The end of any war is never pretty. Both sides race to tie up loose ends. A car bomb blew up one of my crew. Another was poisoned. A third got shot in the back of the head while buying a pack of smokes. A couple of us just vanished without a trace. Every night we waited for Arasaka agents to come finish us off. I had to make a choice. I chose to dig our heels in. I thought we still had a fighting chance. It was bold. It was stupid. A mix of both. Maybe I just didn't know how to walk away. Let it rest. Or maybe I don't know how to lose. Either way, we managed to save a few more agents. The price for that was yours truly. Yeah. I mean, say what you want, but they did trade you. Say what you want, but sounds like they stabbed you in the back, plain and simple. Saving many of my people in the process. You play grown-up games, you face grown-up consequences. Funny. Out of everyone. It was Songbird they asked to pull the trigger. Wait. Yeah. Probably had no choice. Did, didn't. It's irrelevant now. What happened, happened. I was leaving the city, heading home. Songbird was still here. In this very room, in fact. She was guiding me on comms. Led me straight into a trap. Neutralizing me. The last assignment in Night City. Then she got a ticket home. Reed, what are you doing now? This saving her, or is it revenge? I don't have a ventral bone left in me. I had plenty of time to examine this under a microscope. Under focus, some things sharpen, others blur. But there comes a point when you just cut through the bullshit and see what's in front of you. Songbird is still my people, and nothing can change that. Fuck, Reed. Now, my is is a whole nother story. But Songbird, no. I got nothing against her. So uh -huh. why Myers? Yeah. I miss anything? Some reminiscing. So good. Let's get this show going. I checked up on Slider's contention. Fucking had it right, it turns out. I dove into old mission files wherever Somi was involved. They were buried deep, near impossible to access, even with my clearance. Each and every one, the Blackwall. All authorizations, mission orders, personally signed by one person, Rosalind Myers. Wouldn't want to be in her shoes if that shit floats to the top. The NUS is a small country governed by a woman with highly ambitious goals. Sometimes those ambitions went out of reason. But that's not something we need to pour over now. Alex, what do you have for us? Oh, a little of this, a little of that. We'll plan in a sec. Say, V. Like playing fancy dress up? All right, well, of course. Who doesn't? Mm, then you'll like what I whipped up. Managed to learn that some pop megastar is going to grace the party with a show. Guest list? Expect everybody who's anybody. 
That includes you. Gonna don fancy outfits and rub shoulders with VIPs. Be warned, though. Fancy doesn't mean easy. Ready for the deets, V? Oh, shit. Hello. No, but you're gonna dump mommy anyway. Black Sapphire, the most heavily guarded place in Dogtown. Doesn't mean security's airtight, though. V, you're gonna enter through a flooded tunnel system. Got a top-of-the-line diving suit, ought to fit you snug as a glove. Water's maybe a little super toxic. So yeah, be careful. Little super toxic? Excuse you? What about Reed? Was just about to mention, he'll be there too, of course. Already know what the hotel looks like. Really, really hard to miss. Flooded tunnels here. That's your way inside. Now focus. You'll reach a terminal at the end. Jack in and breach the cams, giving Reed his window to slip into the building. You'll take different elevators up, here. Saul will open a passage to his side. For you ask, yeah, it's the only way. Area could be heavily guarded, so you'll have to be on your tippy toes. Couldn't get clean intel, so you'll just have to be creative. Improvise. Of course. You're gonna meet here. Soon as you meet up, you'll doll up like it's prom night and go to the ball. That's where you'll rendezvous with Songbird. All clear? Yeah. Yep. Prem. Okay, let's talk gear. Take your time. Grab anything you think might be useful. Right. A surprise awaits you in the box. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, hello, gorgeous. This your iron? Sure is. Her Majesty's been itching to return to active duty. It'd be an honor. <laughs> nice. I'm down for that. Heads. What did he want in return for the favor he did us? <sighs> Got an invisible war going on in Dogtown. Hansen against anyone who wants a slice of the pie. Hans sees an opportunity, wants my help in exploiting it. Politics. It's the same shit wherever you go. Yeah, of course. You know, if not for you, we'd have no way of getting into the Black Sapphire reaching Somburg. It's good to have you on our side. I mean that, V. That it? We sit? I believe we are. I'll hang back a while. And then meet you there. All righty. Place stinks of memories, huh? A little dusty, but well preserved. What are we gonna do with it once I'm on the Riviera? Gonna lock yourself in here, fondle all this old dead tech till your balls shrivel up? Burn it to the ground's what we'll do, and never come back. Now that I like. All right. So, got a little bit more progress on that, which is nice. And, on to the next step. But first, one thing we definitely need to do. Get that terror card. I don't think it's something we can easily get over here. But let us. Oh God! Wow. It's bright. Where are you, you son of a bitch? Are you here somewhere? There you are. King of Swords. Oh, this is the underground. Okay, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Alright. That is the only thing stopping another bird flu or swine flu or whatever flu. Well, I think we're at a good spot to call it here. We met Mr. Hands. We got a little bit more progress. And 
Got some other stuff that we can do. But with that being said, we are going to call it here. So here we are, constructing thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you do want to see more, you stick around because next time we're going to go in a flooded tunnel. Why not? Until then, see you next time.